An airline jet engine recall will likely ground some of Hawaiian Airlines' planes. The company says the aircraft affected are mainly those that fly to the mainland. Manolo Morales has more. The recall by manufacturer Pratt & Whitney applies to engines that power the Airbus A321neo planes. The company says Hawaiian Airlines has 18 of them in its mainland fleet. Pratt & Whitney has said it recently discovered contamination in the metals used to make some engine parts that could result in certain parts wearing out faster than expected. Aviation expert Peter Foreman says the engines are fairly new and are known to be very reliable. There's some question about um, something with the reliability and uh, they're going to have to fix that. So um, what the airlines do is they take a, a few of the airplanes out of the fleet at a time, get them over to the manufacturer, have the manufacturer work their magic on them and get them back. Foreman says the bad thing is that the engine recall affects a significant part of the mainland fleet, but Hawaiian should be able to ground just a few planes at one time as they are inspected on the mainland. It's not going to be a huge number, and the, there's plenty of seats going to go back and forth to all their locations. It's just that Hawaiian is going to have to tweak their schedule a little bit. A spokesman for Hawaiian Airlines says the aircraft primarily serves small to mid-sized West Coast to Hawaii routes. As far as how the recall will affect the flight schedule, the company sent a statement saying, it's too early to tell as we haven't yet fully calibrated the impact Pratt & Whitney's recent announcement will have on our fleet. We are working closely with PNW to learn more. Foreman says most airlines have spare aircraft, but Hawaiian probably doesn't have enough to cover the amount affected, so he says there will be fewer flights to some of the routes. I asked if fewer flights would lead to higher fares. One airline having a small reduction in flying isn't shouldn't affect the, the fares simply because uh, there's enough other people to pick up the slack in the meantime. The engines will have to be inspected within the next 12 months. Manolo Morales, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.